Gamers.com. Today I'm going to be talking about Eclipse, um, the Java compiler um, for um, for um, web people who develop web apps, uh, JSP, Java server pages. And uh, I'm going to show you how to down, um, download Apache Tomcat. Um, I like uh, Eclipse Helios because it gives you more options if you um, develop uh, mobile applications. Uh, you can you can download the SDK onto that. Um, some of the other and to go and get uh, guy Leo only do one or the other. Um, but first, what you want to do is download Eclipse IDE for Java EE developers. Um, then you want to go to Apache Tomcat and download the core zip file. Um, and provide these links. And uh, once uh, once those are downloaded, uh, you're gonna see clips come up. If I can get it come up here, um, and you're gonna browse. And uh, this is where your workspace is. You want to keep this the same, cause uh, if you change or move it, uh, you will not be able to get into your files again. So uh, I want to select that. Let me just see if I can actually get it. Now while that loads. Okay, can I open? Alright, well, what you want to do is uh, go to Eclipse, Preferences, Select Server, Runtime Environments. Um, I already have one, but you press, you would, you would uh, press Add. And what you need to write in here, Apache Time, that will automatically come up. Um, there will be something that comes up, but you need to direct it to wherever your Tomcat was installed. Tomcat Apache, you just um, uh, downloaded wherever that's at. And you want to click JVM Contents Mac OS X Default. Okay, finish. Okay, um, next you want to go to Window, Show View, Other. Um, servers okay Are you have it up um, and uh, you want to come down here um, right uh, right click new server um, Tomcat localhost Server name well, that will automatically generate this. This is just if you have already any um, dynamic um, web projects already over there, you want to move it over and um, basically. So, um, your servers will come up automatically, your servers folder on the left side will come up automatically. So, what I want to do is start this. Consoles, of course, going through. All right, so, um, other. Go down to web. And click dynamic web project. Um, project name. Uh, video. Oh, all that's fine. Click finish. Yes. All right. Now you have video. Click down. Web content. And uh, you want to click web content and create a new JSP file. And uh, I always create every project I have. I always create an index. Dot JSP because that's just the uh, the root file that usually is connected to in most um JSP 
pages. Finish. Edit body. Just put a simple. It works. It was click index.jsp. Run it, and you will see that it works. Uh, I added a little one, but um. Thank you. Uh, subscribe to my channel, Techno Formers, and uh, thank you, and have a nice day.